Hello again. I see you're back for more design inspiration. Awesome. Well, I'm so excited to be meeting with you again. And this time you're remodeling a bathroom. Okay. So I just want to make sure nothing has changed for your client profile. So is your home address the same? And what about your phone number? Okay. And then, has your email changed? It did? What is it? Alright, so getting started, are you doing the renovation by yourself? Or are you using an architect? Okay, so mostly yourself, but might get some help if needed. So you're really looking for some design inspiration, kind of some ideas. Okay. And then what is your time frame for the project? Okay, yeah, that's pretty normal. Well, once we start looking at the vanities, tile, paint, lighting, everything like that. I can work with you on a budget, so we don't have to have it all nailed down today. But I think that's a good start for now. And then is this the master bath or the guest? Guest bath. And is there a certain look you're going for, a certain style? Okay. Kind of open. And then what about colors? So maybe neutral, school tones. Yeah, I can show you. I have some paint books, so I can give you some ideas. And then I just want to confirm. So you're looking to change out the tile in the shower, paint on the walls, and the vanity and lighting. And then do you have pictures of the current bathroom? Okay. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so we can easily change that around and then that bath doesn't look too old. What year was your house built? And then for billing, just as a reminder, nothing has changed since the last time you and I worked together. But I do have a fixed hourly rate. Today's session is free, of course. And then once I start working by the hour with you, that's when you would start being charged. Since this is a very small scale project, the hourly rate will be a bit lower than usual. Not like the kitchen renovation that we did. And since you're a returning client, you also get a discount. So why don't I go ahead and start showing you some design ideas. These pictures are actually from past bathrooms I renovated. And then we can go through some paint ideas, if that sounds good. So let's show you the photos some ideas. Okay, so I just have them all on my phone, but usually I'd have an iPad, it's just not working right now. Alright, so I'm going to start off by showing you some, well, I guess, let's see, I have tile. Uh, I don't really have these all in order, so I'll just show you. Alright, so here's a tile option. So it's obviously very simple with the black hardware. Then we have this, which is a very common style, just the subway tile. Again, with black features. And this is kind of a nice built-in shelf if 
Maybe you'd be interested in that. Nice for storage. And I know you said maybe some cool tones. So this is a bright blue, but it's definitely more of a unique type of shower option. So it's the subway tile, but it's blue, and I think it's really pretty. Just kind of brightens up the area. So here's the first vanity example. It's a wooden vanity, and then you can see the style of light up there, white countertops. So that's one style. This one is a little bit more modern. So you have kind of a cool looking sink. And then a really cool light fixture. And so that's if you're looking for, again, something a little less common. And if you're into the blues, blues and golds, this is always a pretty option. It's like a dark blue, white marble countertop. And then this is a popular style right now, that color. Vanity, very popular. These light fixtures are very popular. And actually an inexpensive option too. You can get these for a really good price. So this is more bright and open. And then obviously in that one too, there was only a tub. I think this one we did is really pretty recently too. If you like greens, green's always a pretty color for a bathroom. And then I like this mirror. And you can see the tile if I zoom in. It's like kind of a white gray with gold hardware. And obviously we can customize any of these ideas. Oh, it's just kind of starting points. There's another pretty light fixture that I recently installed. And if you're looking for something really out of the norm, a pink bathroom is always a good idea. So I like this if you are doing a kid's bathroom or even just, again, a different type of look. It's not as common, and I think that's what makes it really cool. And this is a very unique. So this is if you really like a lot of different pattern colors, but this style is not for everyone, so up to you. And here's another one kind of plain, but you can again see the color of the vanity if you like that. And then let's see a few more white vanity. Any tan vanity, very popular. And then a gray vanity, which I don't think I've shown you yet. That one. Wallpaper, which is coming back in style. So lots of different options. Did any of those look appealing to you? I know, it's overwhelming, but trust me, I can bring over some samples like we did for the kitchen and see what might work best. And I think once you actually see the pieces up against the wall and we have some paint swaps, you'll get more of an idea. So let's go through the 
paint colors. So like I said, I have two books currently to show you. So, which one is this? The Neutrals. And the Cool Tones. So, do you have a preference of what we look at first? So then let's do the cool tones. So here we go. And I will just tell you the name of each color. And I'll let you know if I've used it before or not. Just so you know. And this is a great paint. I love this brand of paint looks really great, so I highly recommend it. So this is Irradiant Iris, Blue Dolphin, Zen, I've used this a lot before, Cloudberry, Glistening Gray, Graceful Tin Lizzie Kaleidoscope American Anthem Cracked Slate I've actually used this color on vanities before Blackberry and then blue fjord. So, lots of pretty ones there. Let's see over here. So we have mountain stream, misty aqua, which I've used a lot. This is a popular color I've done a lot. Dust Bunny. Solitary Slate. Elemental. Hikers. Paradise. That's a pretty one. Gray. Sky that's a pure black. 
gray and Dover gray. These are more kind of tans and light browns. So whiskers, cool concrete. Storms coming, Boulder Creek, Rocky Road, Moth Gray, Shark Skin, Discover, Dusty Trail. Lazy afternoon, desert dune, and Stonehenge Grange. This color has been popular recently. Toasted almond, bone white. Best beige pony tail, thunderstruck, and afternoon tea. Now, that's not all of the paint. It's kind of the most popular colors right now. And then this is the sheen guide, which I forgot to show you. So you have flat. Eggshell, satin, or semi gloss. So I can actually put all four sheens on your bathroom wall and then you can see what you like. So, do any of those colors look good? Yeah? Okay, let me write them down. Alright, so what color? Perfect. Yeah, I really like that one. Okay. Yep, you can tell me as many as you want. And that's actually good if you have a lot of different ones that you like because once I start showing you the samples, as you know, you might immediately think one is Alright, so I'll put this all in, and then at this point, any questions for me? Okay, good. So I'm going to put together some mood boards based on the colors you like, and the vanities you like, and kind of everything else. I would recommend you look at Pinterest for some more ideas, and I'll send you some more ideas as well. If you come across anything specific that you for sure want to purchase, please let me know and I can order it for you. And then what else? I guess let's make the appointment for me to come by. So it works for you. Okay. So I can come at one or three. And then I'll confirm the day off just to make sure nothing's changed. Alright. Well, I'm so looking forward to working on this project with you. And then hopefully some more in the near future. So, thanks for choosing me. And then reach out if you have any questions before I stop by. Alright. Well, have a good rest of your day. And I will see you soon.